have this saying if you educate a girl, you educate a nation and you improve a community. So we talk about girls' education most of the time. Most parents think that girls belong in a home. And I encourage girls to say, look, now also encourage parents to say, look, if you educate your child, your girl child, you're going to benefit from it tomorrow. With Liberia coming from the Civil War, uh, girls' education, with educating more girls, we have more women working in government, you know, we will contribute to the rebuilding of our country. We are all from Liberia, and if we are not educated, how are we going to do that? So we encourage parents to, to encourage their girls, you know, to go to school. Right now, as a, a mother and as a wife and as an advocate for girls in Liberia, I highly appreciate the work of the, the government in Liberia. Women in Liberia right now, we are proud. We have produced the first female president in West Africa. Let's say in Africa, not West Africa, and we are proud of that. Our Excellency Mother Ellie Johnson said we are very proud of her. And to continue on that path, we have to educate more girls. If you are not educated, how are you going to get a position? So we have to encourage our girls. That's why you find a lot of girls in school now. Because like I'm telling you, even some of the villages I've been to, when you ask the girls, you ask girls, or even just a single girl, say, who you want to be tomorrow? They will say, I want to be the person of Liberia. Education empowers a girl or a woman. It opens many doors. You have better choices. The more educated we are, the more power we have to get to where we want to get. But without education, it's hard. You might want to talk, but what can you do?